And welcome back. A gorgeous day. We still have the red flag warnings. That's in effect though, 8 o'clock. We also have a frost advisory tonight. That's what the blue is. The reason? We have a low pressure to the north and it's continuing to bring some dry air. That dry air heats up readily and also cools off significantly overnight. Just some patchy frost. Some of the deeper valleys, it's not going to be widespread. So here's the departing system. We have a couple of days of high pressure and then our Saturday soaker is moving into the west right now. Plenty of moisture streaming up from the subtropical jet stream. And as that moves east, it's going to bring us a nice soaking. Unfortunately, because of the timing of it right during our weekend. Here's the shot of some chilly air across northern parts of Pennsylvania, but we got into the mid 60s today, but we only have warmer weather back to the west. These upper 70 readings will be what we will see later in the week in a couple of places topping 80 degrees. We do have some cooler weather out west. That'll be our demarcation in the boundary as it comes through on Saturday. Gorgeous in Marlington at 57, 66 in Pipestem and Beckley. Farther south, we are in the mid 60s in Bluefield. So as we go through your Wednesday, we start out temperatures in the upper 30s. But with this dry air mass, we are going to warm up significantly once again. We'll be well into the 70s. And then on Thursday, with a southerly flow ahead of our storm system, once again, temperatures close to 80 and on Friday. But once we get into Saturday, that's when things change. This storm system tapping moisture from the Gulf of Mexico. We will see plenty of rain, about an inch of rain before all is set and done. There will be some ponding of water on the roadways. And because of that, we do have a medium flood threat, but the creeks and the streams will stay in check. Behind that, we have some cooler air early next week as we get the jet stream dipping a little bit farther south. So on Saturday, just keep in mind that we'll have some downpours and some of those poor drainage areas will experience a little bit of flooding. Now, here's the lowdown. The heat pump is being turned on. We'll have that early weekend deluge and then back to the chilly weather in the 70 forecast. We are talking 75 degrees for your hump day. Thursday's temperature 81. The records, by the way, 83 to 85 degrees. TGIF, we're 80 degrees on Friday. Here's the rain on Saturday. 100% chance of downpours, the high 55. We drop into the low 30s Saturday night. Sunday, a couple of sprinkles, the high 50. Don't plant your flowers just yet. We will see a little bit of a deep freeze Sunday night with lows near 30, and then 55 on Monday and a little bit milder on Tuesday. That's your complete seven day forecast. We are back with more news right after this break.